Hello, good morning. So today I had the feeling that I want to share some business tips with you guys. I know that a lot of people watch my status and I realize that more than half, like 80% of you all are business owners. So I want to share some business tips that I, can, that I know that can work across any field of business at all that you are in. And I'm so sure it's going to be beneficial for you because it's something that I've put to work and I've put to practice as regards my business and as regards the brand itself and it's it's just the best way to go about it. So the first one is embracing quality service. What do I mean? Embracing quality service means that you're looking at the competitors around you, check the services they provide and you do better than what they provide. Like the saying that goes that you are better than your last job. Yes, you are as good as your last job. Let me put it that way. So, as a good business, the mindset of having your business on a long run, like for 20 to 30 years, I think it's quite advisable for you to start giving out quality, um, quality service from day one. Because all of your clients will have a feedback to one another and telling them that, oh, for the past 20 years, I've been patronizing them. They give quality service. For social years, I've been patronizing them. They give quality service. And feedback are, 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 quite, are quite good for business. Like, they're the most important. So number two is finance and understanding finance. Well, that's quite the biggest part for most people. Oh, how am I going to get the money? I, for those who have support system, fine kudos and for those that don't have a support system i know it could be tough at times but one thing i've noticed about business if you understand the scheme around your business is that as the startup try and make sure that you are not profit driven like in most cases for my own business when i start up i was not making profit for the first year yes i was not making profit for the second year i wasn't and i'm now 10 years into the business so what does that mean was that i had a perspective in mind that i'm doing this basically to improve and to increase my awareness to people around me okay and because i wasn't making profit that doesn't mean i was giving low quality service i wasn't in fact i was still the best among my competitors but as time goes i increased my prices and still i've made enough awareness and still i still got clients even more so seriously that's this two tip for today tomorrow i'll share more tips on how you could have a successful business especially in this country nigeria but those are my own highlights thank you for listening see you tomorrow